What fun can you have in a pool anyway that you can't have in a bathtub with a garbage bag taped around your cast? Personalized plates. Barclay, Barry, Bert, Bort. Oh, come on, Bort? Mommy, Mommy, buy me a license plate! No, come along, Bort. Are you talking to me? No, my son is also named Bort. Roger Myers Sr., the gentle genius behind Itchy and Scratchy, loved and cared about almost all the peoples of the world. And he, in return, was beloved by the world. Except in 1938, when he was criticized for his controversial cartoon, Nazi Supermen Are Our Superiors. Among his proudest achievements was the full-length musical, Scratch-tasia. in for Sideshow Bob 100%, for Joe Quimby 1%, and we remind you there is a 1% margin of error. Mm. Oh. All right, let's go live mm. to Bob headquarters now for Mayor Terwilliger's victory speech. And just look how happy he is. <laughs> There's nothing wrong with your television set. Do not attempt to adjust your picture. We are controlling the transmission. What's that, boy? We're in control? Hey, look! I can see my voice! <laughs> half hour, we will control what you see and hear. You are about to experience the terror and foul horror of The Simpsons Halloween Special. Will be a window into his madness. Feeling fine. Wow, that's a relief. <laughs> this is less encouraging. Hello. Uh, what do you think, Marge? All I need is a title. 
I was thinking along the lines of no TV and no beer make Homer something something. Go crazy? Don't mind if I do! Stay away from me, Homer! Give me the bat, Marge! Give me the bat! Give me the bat! Come on! Give me the bat! Give me the bat! Dirty cat! I'm back! Oh, my loving family! Nothing's changed! Idly ho, slaverinos! Oakley doakley! Hey, what the hell is that geek Flanders doing on TV? Oh, I see by the big board we got a negative Nelly in Sector 2. I'm afraid I'm going to have to ask the whole family to kind of freeze and prepare for re-education. Don't you remember, Dad? Flanders is the unquestioned lord and master of the world. Don't! Don't! I mean, hey. Good morning, Father dear. Hope you're well. Are we taking the new Lexus to Aunt Patty and Selma's funeral today? Hmm, fabulous house, well-behaved kids, sisters-in-law dead, luxury sedan. Woohoo! I hit the jackpot! Marge, dear, would you kindly pass me a donut? Donut? What's a donut? Ah! 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 Oh, it's raining again. You're still not in your own world, Homer! I can get you home, but you have to do exactly as I- ah! This is indeed a disturbing universe. Mmm. 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 Mm. This sandwich tastes so young and impudent. <laughs> Seymour, what's with the good grab? Mm. Well, perhaps I ought to let you folks in on a secret. You remember me telling Jimbo Jones that I'd make something of him one day? <gasps> Are you saying you killed Jimbo, processed his carcass, and served him for lunch? Ha! <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Goodbar to the front desk. The front desk is looking for Mr. Goodbar. <gasps> I feel like a kid in some kind of a store. <gasps> yeah! Ooh. Brilliant! Ooh-wee! Exquisite! Ooh, you'll do well. Uh, give me those! Well, as you can see, I have created a lemon ball so sour, it can only be safely contained in a magnetic field. The candy, known as 77X42, it might... Where the hell is the candy? I do know. <laughs> oh, you're gonna have to put some sugar on that celery or get out, ma'am. <laughs> Gummy bears! Gummy calves heads! Gummy jawbreakers! What the? That is the rarest gummy of them all! The gummy Venus de Milo! Carved by gummy artisans who work exclusively in the medium of gummy! Will you two stop saying gummy so much? Must have rare gummy. Distract the salesman. No, I won't make a spectacle out of myself any further. Oh, oh, oh. how'd they get there? <laughs> now, this is going to take all my skill. <laughs> art, art, run, march! Save the booty! After him! He has hey. got it! Got it. We return to Fox Night at the Movies, Homer S. Portrait of an Ass Grabber, starring Dennis Brahms. Ooh, portrait. Sounds classy. Doesn't it? <laughs> no, Mr. 
Mr. Simpson, a cat is a living creature. I don't care. Now I'm gonna grab me some sweet. No, Mr. Simpson, that's sexual harassment. If you keep it up, I'll yell so loud the whole country will hear. <laughs> With the man in the White House? <laughs> Not likely. <laughs> This is hour 57 of our live, round-the-clock coverage outside the Simpson Estate. Remember, by the way, to tune in tonight at 8 o'clock for highlights of today's vigil, including when the garbage man came and when Marge Simpson put the cat out. Possibly because it was harassed, we don't know. Of course, there's no way to see into the Simpson home without some kind of infrared heat-sensitive camera. So let's turn it on. Now, this technology is new to me, but... I'm pretty sure that's Homer Simpson in the oven, rotating slowly. His body temperature has risen to over 400 degrees. He's literally stewing in his own juices. Kids can be so cruel. We can? Thanks, Mom! Ow! Cut out, Bart! <laughs> Who controls the British crown? Who keeps the metric system down? We do! We do! Who leaves Atlantis off the maps? Who keeps the Martians on their rafts? We do! We do! Who holds back the electric car? Who makes the Gutenberg a star? We do! We do! Who robs Kingfish of their sight? Who rigs every Oscar night? We do! <laughs> Wee! Oh, wow. Wee! Ah. oh, for the love of God! Somebody get the jaws of life! Higher! Higher! Oh, I'll give you higher, my filthy little urchin. <sighs> oh. ah. You've won this round. Thank you, Mr. Simpson. Mm, it looks so much better. A beautiful sky blue. Uh-oh. Acid rain again. Actually, I quit and I came to get my job back. Through there. <laughs> so, come crawling back, eh? Seems like the classy thing to do would be not to call attention to it. Thanks for giving me my old job back. I'm afraid it's not that simple. As punishment for your desertion, it's company policy to give you the plague. Uh, sir, that's the plaque. Ah, yes. The special demotivational plaque to break what's left of your spirit. Because, you see, you're here forever. Don't forget, you're here forever. Oh. You loved her right from the start. <laughs> Absolutely. Then why no pictures? Oh, there are pictures. I keep them where I need the most cheering up.
left at 1.30 p.m. Monday. What time is it now? It's 6.45 a.m. next Wednesday. You may also be interested to know that it's summer here, not winter. Oh. What does that sign say? I thought they spoke English in this country. It says you can't bring in outside plants or animals. Any foreign creature you bring in could upset the environmental balance. Oh. Sorry, girl. I don't want to get in any more trouble down here. I'll pick you up on the way home. Mom, you said I could have one souvenir, right? Well, I want a didgeridoo. <laughs> Very noisy and expensive for a souvenir. Hmm. Why don't you get this nice camp? It's clever, just like you. Huh? Hmm? Oh, come on. Get out. Get out. Oh, shoot. Shoot. Get out of here. Ugh. These bloody things are everywhere. They're in the lift, in the lorry, in the bone wizard, and all over the Malonga Gildachuck. They're like kangaroos. What's the reptiles they use? We have them in America. They're called bullfrogs. What? That's an odd name. I'd have called them chaswazzers. Please. Oh, the Simpsons. Well, they're not getting back in here. Next, they're gonna show my movie! You made a movie? I made a movie? No wonder I was on the cover of Entertainment Weekly. My name is Barney Gumble. I'm 40, I'm single, and I drink. There's a line of a fellow about a drinker, now a sensible man, by and by a fool, presently a beast. That pretty well covers it. It's brilliant. Savagely honest, tender, he has the soul of a poet. You're very kind! Excuse me, did something crawl down your throat and die? It didn't die! My name is Barney, and I'm an alcoholic. Mr. Gumbel, this is a Girl Scout meeting. Is it? Or is it that you girls can't admit you have a problem? Don't cry for me. I'm already dead. Jazz man happy, Lisa. You must avenge my death, Kimba. I mean, Simba. Luke, I am your father. This is CNN. Will you guys pipe down? I'm saying goodbye to Lisa. We're sorry. I don't want you to go. Sorry, but I have to. Goodbye. <laughs> What the heck? Once more from the top.
Hey, stop talking bad about my town, man. Why don't you make me? I don't make trash, I burn it. Then I guess you're a garbage man. Well, I know you are, but what am I? A garbage man. Oh, I know you are, but what am I? A garbage man. I know you are, but what am I? A garbage man. Takes one to know one. Checkmate! Hey, kid, stop wearing your backpack over one shoulder. We invented that. Copycats. Uh, you copied us. Step over this line and say that. I'll kick your butt. Mad Nintendo. I just put a rock in your crummy town. That's a crud rock. It belongs in crud town. <laughs> <laughs> Look at the weak little baby. You're stupid, you stupid weak baby. Come on, let's get out of here. Hey, they're taking our lemons. We can't spare a single one. <laughs> you just got citric acid in my eye. You'll pay for that, Springfield. Well, it's friendly Springfield. Hello there, neighbors. Uh, you know, we think some kids of ours may be missing in your town. Missing yeah. children. Sounds like Springfield's got a discipline problem. Yeah, maybe that's why we beat him at football nearly half the time, huh? <laughs> 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 no one in history has ever done anything this clever. I'll get the gate. <laughs> That's okay, son. I'll take care of him. <laughs> Faster, son! He's got a taste for meat now! <laughs> Get out here, son! There's a doings a transpiring! Let's shut the gate and seal them in! Got it, Flanders! It won't start. Something's draining the battery. Sorry. Oh! We made it! Yeah! Woohoo! Eat my shorts, Shelbyville! Eat, eat my, my shorts! Yes, eat all of our shirts! Oh, you lousy Springfielder! You shake harder, boy! And with that, a mighty cheer went up from the heroes of Springfield. They had brought the sacred tree back to its native soil. And though Flanders was stuck with the impound fee, he could easily afford it. More lemonade, Bart? Absolutely. Say when. There are over 14 parts of the lemon that are... And with that, a mighty cheer went up from the heroes of Shelbyville. They had banished the awful lemon tree forever because it was haunted. Now let's all celebrate with a cool glass of turnip juice. <laughs> Just a minute. <laughs> Who the devil are you? Oh, Mac Simpson! What? What are you talking Simpson? about? Don't Homer really Simpson. make sense, man. Shut up. I can't understand a word you're Homer saying. Simpson. You're just babbling in your head. My name is Homer Simpson! Oh, you're a dead man. Oh, you're dead! You're dead, bird! Ah, perpetual twilight bathed in the glow of Burns brand electricity. Hello, lamp post. What you knowin'? I've come to watch your power flowing. That's odd. Mr. Smithers left his jacket behind. Whoa, that's odd. Principal Skinner left his mother behind. <laughs> That's odd. Where's Homer? And Bart? And Lisa? And Grandpa? After all these years, things are finally starting to go my way. <laughs> I feel like celebrating. I... Oh, it's you. What are you so happy about? <gasps> I see. I think you'd better drop it. I said drop it! <laughs> 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 <laughs>
to get to get your hands off. Where is everybody? Oh, hey, man, are you okay? Won't dignify that with response. Mr. Burns has been shot. Just a minute. This isn't Mr. Burns at all. It's a mask. Oh, wait, it is Burns. <laughs> His wrinkly skin look, looks like a mask. I don't think we'll ever know who did this. Everyone in town's a suspect. <laughs> well, I couldn't possibly solve this mystery. Can you? Yeah, I'll give it a shot. I mean, uh, it's my job, right? <laughs>